So here we have the integral ln(x) over x, and let me show you how we can take care of this. Two ways. The first way is let's use integration by parts. So let me put on the di on the side, and then I will have the plus minus ready on the side data as well. We have two functions, ln x, and then the other one is 1 over x. Let me integrate 1 over x, because to integrate ln x will be much harder. You have to use integration parts for that. Let me differentiate ln x, OK? Integral of 1 over x is ln x. But then when you differentiate ln x, you get 1 over x. This is actually a third stop situation. Because if you look at the function part, 1 over x times ln x, that's the repeat of the original. But then now, we can also set this up. Okay? First, you see that positive ln x times ln x, that's just ln x, all together raised to a second power. Let me write it down as ln x in the parentheses raised to a second power for the product of this diagonal. And then remember, the product of a row it is still an integral. This is going to be a minus integral, minus integral of 1 over x times ln x, which is the same as ln x over x dx, isn't it? OK? And then the deal is, I will add this on both sides. Plus integral ln x over x dx plus ln x over x dx for the integral. And then you will see this and that cancel out. One integral plus another one, we have two of them. So we have two integral of ln x over x dx. And this is the same as ln x in the parentheses to the second power. But then we are not done yet because we don't want to have this two. It's OK. Let's multiply both sides by 1 half so that this and that cancel. And finally, we can say, let me just put it down right here, integral ln x over x dx. This will be 1 half of ln x and then raised to a second power. This is the function part of the answer. We are done. And at the end, we'll put a plus c. This is it. OK? And this is use integration by part. We can also do it with another way. Let's take a look of the same integral. Let me just write it down right here. Integral of ln x over x dx. But this time, I'll just put it on the side like this. I will do it with u substitution. <laughs> Let me say u equals to ln x to begin with. And I will do du. The derivative of ln x is 1 over x dx. As you can see, this is the same as integral the ln x, it's the same as u, so we have u on the top. And let me show you guys the cancellation. We have the over x, but the dx, let me multiply both sides by x on both sides here. We get dx equals to x du. I will replace this with dx right here, x du. And you see that x and x cancel out. Altogether, we are integrating u du. And then this is you add 1, divide by 2. Add 1 to the exponent, divide by 2, like 1 half, u to the second power. At the end, you go back to the x world. So this is 1 half. Let me open the parentheses for the u, which is ln x in the parentheses raised to the second power. And then we are also done. Which one did you like better?